What is up guys welcome back to another reaction of One Piece this is chapter 993 so before we actually get into 993 it just actually came out I was refreshing it it says our is my day of surprisingly so it just works out perfectly anyway last chapter there's a big thing going on about basically either we overestimate Kaido or we underestimated 9 Akasaya Akasaya 9 sorry that was weird Anyway, um, before that, let's start with the start where Marco and um, Perespero, they were talking about the dealers off. But then Big Mom said, yeah, that's right. Dead man gave no orders. And then she made those freaking scared. You know the face that Queen got scared and put like 100% pure um, sea prison stone and then took her to Onigashima. That, that's the sad, scary face he gave to Marco but Marco seems fine he doesn't seem freaked out but there is something definitely going on and then Carrot running there to avenge uh, Petro and obviously Perspero is the enemy so I wonder if Marco and Carrot gonna fight together also Wanda was running behind her so I guess there is something like those three might have to team up to fight Big Mom and Paris Pro. I'm not sure if the other kids gonna show up as well. What I mean by like smoothie and stuff. So looking forward to seeing what's gonna happen there. And then uh, Black Maria singing, right? It's almost, there's a few things I noticed because one sees, sees in the same business, right? Like the both are like red district businesses. Um, so that same goes for Hiori. And she learned to sing. She was learning before that, before Black Maria ever showed up. And also, as you guys noticed before, Black Maria behavior is suspicious. Because once she doesn't, she was trying to make Orochi and uh, Kaido drunk. And she doesn't seem to be bothered about climbing up in power level wise. Uh, what I mean by that in uh, ranking wise, she doesn't really care about becoming a lead performer. So, is, that, is, that, is, it is there any possibility that she could be actually part of... Um, Odin's allies. Surprise. Anyway, we'll see. And then, um, again, coming back to the fight, there was a few things, right? I mean, okay, even if we underestimated, see the part where they're using, uh, using Odin's move? That, that was fine for me, right? It, it's, he is, they injured at the same exact place, the cross, uh, true sword style, etc., etc. But, the part where Rezo came up with that, it, it's just, we weren't expecting it. That's probably why we have like this mixed feeling whether Akasaya 9 is stronger than we expected or did they get stronger, trained, what, I mean, it's clear they're trained, but still, it is, it's a big jump, right? I mean, before they had no chance, like with Odin, they had no chance, but then now they are actually having a, you know they they're contributing a lot and that's actually injuring um kaido i can understand the people who didn't time skip they you know they had 20 years to improve but like Rezo time skipped he had like what six months and was he improving he was hiding most of the time and then what happened just it's just it's like it's like a basically in a confused state i would like to know your thoughts if you guys mind do comment below. I'll check them out. Anyway, that's the end of that. Let me close my note. And let's get into chapter 993. Next chapter is coming in seven days, which is good. No break. Um, there are seven more chapters, people, after this. And I heard Oda's uh, goal was to actually get it to 1,000 before the end of this year. And the big 1,000 chapter is going to be something epic. I'm so looking forward to I don't know if that's going to be Luffy versus Kaido. I, I don't know. The pace is kind of improved. I mean, well, rather getting faster. So I'm expecting something to happen. Anyway, let's go full screen. There we go. The Dream of Wano. Okay. The Dream of Wano. That's the title. Oh, okay. Goti and uh, Lola, they're both getting married. Gang bitch. Oh, my family. Goti and Lola's wedding. All right, and his father is also, I mean, her father is also there. That's very nice. Okay. So what? <laughs> it's nice that Pess actually standing top of uh, his, his, what is it, ponytail? Whatever that's 
call the name. All right, let's go and get into the first page, people. Wait, is there something hidden? No, I don't. I don't see anything. This story been going on for so long. I'm kind of wondering what's the point, but I'm pretty sure there should be a point at the end of it. Let's go. The flower capital. It's the night. It's the night. The flower capital. It's the night of the Grand Fire Festival. Here in the flower capital, Gya ha 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 ha, the lone place that flourish in Wano, the smiles of the people covers up the fears and pressure that look behind them. Okay, so this is the day to let loose, sort of. They were able to survive because of the furtive belief that the country would be served by the Kosuki Samurai one day. A legend that seems plausible enough to support their faith. Okay. This one just remind me of Yamato, the first, like the bottom panel of the first page. And then here, I don't know, kind of... Who does he? He actually remind me of one of the Onibawashu. Uh, Alright, I wish this day would never... Okay, this is one of the child's dreams. Won't have another drop of drink for entire year once this festival is over. So that's the master or legendary carpenter. Okay, damn it. If only Orochi didn't have Kaido backing him up. Okay, so that truth, true feeling coming out, it seems. All right, you know what I think? I think the Koseki clan's battle is happening right now. I bet they recruited warriors from all over the world to help and they went to Onigashima and sliced up Orochi and Kaido and raised hell. Well, Orochi is sliced up, so we'll see. That's right, you tell them. Today is the day we, when everyone can speak their dreams aloud. Ah, this water is so fresh and okay, these are the people from um, the Smile Town. What a day of luxury. Ibusu town, by the way. Uh, the air is so fresh here. Breathe in all you want. Wait, there's no smoke coming out. So it's even on that day, it's day off for the prisoners. Interesting. No one will be executed today. It's the best day of the year. Orochi will be back. But for now, sing, dance, enjoy yourself. For, the, for today is the fire festival. Okay, this is what's happening in Wano. And then we're coming back to Onigashima. Okay, there's like a big boom going on. You can see the wave crashing in. All right, look out. Run away. Don't let them catch you. They will slice you up. Okay, who the hell are they? What is that? Uh, wait. They are actually slicing up Kaidos. Well, they're actually slicing indiscriminately, I think. That was Queen. It really is a block. Oh, okay, wait, this is different kind than from what we got from the um, Udon. Okay, it's interesting because we actually got that episode out today, which the reaction will be out later, guys, if you want to check it out, anime reaction. Anyway, um, it's plug, it really is a plug. Help, it's cold, I am turning into an Oni. Dude, okay, they're actually eating. The samurai and the others. Okay. Yeah, they've been infected. Close the doors to every tower. This floor is finished. This is the shining jewel of my plug round. Ice Oni. Okay. First basement level. Oh, damn. Okay. So there's like a five level and they have to, Luffy have to clear five level to get up there. Okay. Out of my way. Hey, wait, Luffy. Oof. Okay, who just held him? Oh, okay, that's uh, Sanji. Party table kick course. All right, those, come on. Those small fries doesn't need fire. Come on. All right. Hey, you. You will pay for what you did to me. Did to my guys. Prepare for a beat down. Okay. That is a very weird smile devil fruit. Here's one of his arm turned into a gorilla. That's crazy. Why is the gorilla growing out of there? <laughs> Okay, you won't get past me. Brishik Cola. Gorilla Smile Fruit. Animal Kingdom Pirate. Head oh, he's a headliner. 
Interesting. Oh yeah, a couple of wise guys, huh? Oh, you are a couple of wise guys, huh? Well, I, I wouldn't say the guy wise part. I mean, come on. All right. Like, oog, oog. Then why don't you tell me how a gorilla is supposed to grow? How should I know? Anyway, Gorilla Punch Punch. Okay, that's a, actually a weird name if you think about it. Because he's using a punch as a gorilla and the gorilla itself is punching. Anyway, whoa, that was pretty powerful. Okay, but Sanji seems to touch it, obviously. Hey, there's a bunch back there too. All right, I will take care of them. How many times do we have to tell you to conserve your strength for Kaido? They're not going to let Luffy fight at all until to get to the top. I mean, they're like a small fry for Luffy, right? So we don't need to... He don't need to really put so much... I guess every bit of energy matter for Kaido. Anyway, it will take you too long to handle all these guys alone. Shut up. Is 10 seconds long for you? I will do it in three. Fish man. Oh, okay. Jimbe, Jimbe coming in with the shark break fist. Okay, the gorilla fist and the gorilla guy or Bissamo, whatever the headliner is out. Oh, no. Briscola. Okay, Briscola. Luffy, Sanji. I figured I would find you here. Jimbe, I'm getting you up to the roof. You must conserve your power. Who put you in charge? I'm the one dragging Luffy along. Oh, you are? Sorry. You know, Jimbe is so mature, he don't even bother fighting. He's like, oh, you are? Okay, fine, sure. I mean, if, it's, if it's Zoro, he'll be like, huh? No, it would be me. He's like, no, it's a you know, fight. The samurai should have reached the top of the battlefield. We ought to head there. How do you know everything that's happening? <laughs> Watch out, because if Luffy gets a chance to fight, he will take it. I will keep that in mind. Okay, so is Jimbe taking him there while Sanji staying at the ground floor? Are they both going? Oh, okay, there is a cat with an eye. Okay, that's the girl, right? The girl who gave the schedule information. Meow. Okay, wait up. Yamato and Momonosuke pass through the right brain tower. Okay, they are heading to the outside. Good and Ba Hung. This is King. The enemy strength is about 5,400. Most of them are samurai rallying around Odin's vassals. In other words, this is a rebellion of the Koseki clan to restore their house to power. They seek to place Odin's son, Koseki Momonosuke, upon the Shogun's throne of Wano. Kill Momonosuke and bring his head to me. That will break the will of samurai's fight. Samurai to fight. Okay, so King just made sure Momo is the target. Okay, this is going to be interesting. The pirate will be a separate matter, I suppose. Momonosuke is current location is. Hey, wait. Give it a rest. Okay, so... Shinobu and Momo is running away from uh, Yamato. Oh, and Sasaki already found him. Okay, got it. Found him. Take aim. Fire. Okay, those guns are not easy. You can see there's a bit of arrows as well. They are not weak. They cause an explosion. It's like cannon shot. All right. Okay, why does Shinobu look so freaked out in this panel? What's happening in the next one? Oh, more arrows coming up. Ooh, oh, okay. So Shinobu shield Momo with her own body. Okay, you can see she's coughing up blood. They're like, Shinobu, what's happening? Stay out of this, Kunoichi. But now, this ends. Shinobu, run Lord Momonosuke. Okay, see, just pushed Momo aside. Okay, who is this old man in the first place? That's like a turtle? He have a, like an axe as well. Okay, double-edged axe. And... Alright, you can see... Yamato just knocked that old man over. One-shotted. Okay. There's few weird gifters are here. Okay, that guy with that... Uh, what is it called? Kabuto, Kabuto beetle? That guy has been there so many places and so is the scrap girl one one day warning zoro to get out did zoro just left them there without taking them down that's so unlike zoro anyway 
Animal Kingdom Pirates, Armored Division. Okay, Sasaki is just chilling at the back. Uh, I guess this guy is part of that elephant. Alright, so you inter intend to interfere with this young master Yamato. I'm not interfering. I am fighting for Kozuki. Alright, Yamato making his, well, her intention clear. I don't think Sasaki know that's a girl. It, it shouldn't really matter. He's crazy strong anyway. Alright, Skull Dome. Okay, we are back up there. Severe his windpipe. Stop his breathing. This fight ain't over until his head is severed. Injure spirit. I saw the vision of Kosuki Odin. I could have let you kill me with each throb of my scar. Father, help. Okay, he is remembering that dirty work, right? Um, let's see, I remember. But you people are not Odin. We will never see a monster samurai of his likes again. Ah, oh, man. Imagine if Zoro actually take that place. Well, he will, right, eventually. What he is calling is, we will not see a monster. It's just a goosebump moment here. Because if you think about it, he is hyping up Odin. Kaido bought a bribe from Odin. I mean, he is praising Odin because that's how strong he is. He's saying, he can, we can, I can sense you, some will of Odin from you, but you are not him. So I won't let you kill me. So he's basically willing to die by Odin's hand because of what happened in the battle. Because he know Odin could have defeated him. But yeah. Alright. That hype is enough. Let's go to the next page. It's too shallow. You don't even have enough power to open up the old scar. Okay, he's saying is okay, you managed to make a damage, but that's not even, you know, it's not worth it. Okay, um, you cannot do it. Ha, ooh. Okay, his breath is coming like a slice. Invisible slashes. Dude. Okiku's arm just... Bl Damn. Look at everybody's reaction. Okay, I was expecting, personally, I was expecting people to die. But then, already Kawamatsu got sent flying. We didn't get to... Wait, no, he's there. Kawamatsu is back. So he, he doesn't seem like he's actually got much injury from it in the last course. But look at that. Okiku actually, she saw, okay, she saw it. She def tried to defend it. But it sliced the blade and then sliced off her. Damn, okay. All right, so that's the... No, just the arm. Okay, I, I was actually looking at her leg because it's kind of like a black shaded. I'm not sure if that's supposed to mean anything. But it's just this part got sliced, like taken off. Wow, okay, that is the end. The next chapter is hitting on the number first, people. All right. So Kaido is taking it seriously. He's trying to finish them off. And then Luffy have to eventually get here. I guess that will be when all the other Samurais are defeated. And some of them might be killed. All right, let's quickly go over what exactly happened. Start, we got Goti and Lola married. And then we got to see what the actual Wano want, you know. All of their thoughts are coming out. They're putting their hope. This is their last hope. If they get defeated, I don't I don't see them coming back out. And Orochi is dead, just so you guys know, you know, because they don't know that. And then um, the bullets Queen used, it's to turn people into Oni. I'm not sure if Chopper can do anything about it. I hope he can, but it might take some time. So this is going to be interesting, but it doesn't seem like it's infecting others. Or does it? No, it doesn't seem like it's infecting, so... It's just those Oni, the winter Oni he created, it's going to kill a lot of Samurais and their own people. So they also lose their ability to think when they turn into an Oni. And then um, he's sealing off that place so everybody will either get sliced or get killed off. So x Drake and Zoro is there, so that's not going to happen technically. They can open up a path, but I'm actually looking forward to seeing what's going to happen. 
Let's go. Oh, wait, wait, wait. No, no, no. I got it wrong. Because if you look at the panel on 6 and 7, the part where he's bite is almost like zombie. If you bite, if you get bitten or if you get touched by the plug, you're also turning into, because you can see that skin is turning. I'm not sure if, if I'm actually interpreting this correctly, but their skin turning in cold. And this guy's like, help, I'm t it's cold. I'm turning into an Oni. So if it, if it hits you, you will turn into an Oni? Interesting. Anyway, and then we got to meet this weird headliner. But yeah, he's weak as hell. Jimbe took him down just like that. And yeah, it seems like Jimbe, Sanji and um, Luffy, they're all going up. Or either Jimbe and Luffy alone going up. Uh, that hasn't been confirmed on the next panel. Anyway, and then we got to know what's happening. Um, so right now, everybody is, well, most of them are focused on momo getting rid of momo because that he's like the leader technically that's not the case at this point they just i don't think they care momo being the leader they do give respect to momo but i don't think they will stop just because momo got sliced off i don't think that will be the case um and then well we are also going to get to see uh yamato fighting all of these uh gifters so i'm actually looking forward to armored division rather uh, so I'm actually looking forward to that. Hopefully anime will do a bit better job and expand, expand on it. So looking forward to that. And then obviously over here, Kaido just hyped up Oden. He sliced off Okiku. So I'm looking forward to the next chapter, people. Let me know your thoughts, your reaction, any theory, anything that you could think of. And also what do you guys think of the last chapter when it's come to power level wise? You think what happened like everybody is injuring but you can see kaido is not down that's what i like even though like, the moment where everybody to taking orders post that was epic hype but kaido is not down just like he said you are not strong as ordered all of them put together is not strong enough to take down kaido even kaido himself admit Oden is stronger than him that's what this chapter hyped me up about so i'm so looking forward to the next chapter i hope okiku just pass out I hope, I really hope that, but I don't know what will be the case because again, we are going against a Kaido. It's like when we went against Big Mom, Petro got killed. Uh, well, rather, Petro sa sacrificed himself. So it's not, it, you know, you can't come back without any damage and we are already seeing some damages, but I just really hope she is knocked down rather than dead. So... Let me know your thoughts, your reaction in the comment section. Hope you guys enjoy the chapter reaction from me. If you did, do leave a thumbs up. Oh, by the way, I think because of the last chapter, we actually got to see the power level clearly, the difference. Even after all that, Kaido still able to take down just like that. Just with breathing. And then sliced. Anyway, thank you so much for reading with me. Stay safe, people. Have a wonderful day or night. And see you guys with more videos.